Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to go over the Grasshopper script that I created where you can create your own spiral staircase depending on whatever size you want. So this is a fully parametric design. So I will have this in the description below so you can download it and take a look and see see what you think. So we're going to go here to Grasshopper and in Grasshopper. Let's open the file. We had never opened it. And what you'll see is we have the full spiral staircase here. And um, I'm going to go over here in the script, kind of show you the steps of how I, it was kind of created. So we start with the basic circle um, so it's created with the circle inside of grasshopper and in here you can see that we can you know this the diameter of the circle can kind of get smaller or it could get, get bigger depending on how how wide you, you want the stairs you can make them narrow or you can make them wider and uh, the distance that's offset we have here and it's multiplied. Let's see. No, that's not. Um, and so here we have the distances. So we have an idea of how big the distances of the tread here. And so here's a number of steps. You can choose twenties before before you can. You have to create a landing, but that's kind of how you cut you can just keep going up and up and up and so that's what determines the height there and let's see what else what other parameters we have we have the slab thickness here at the top we can make it thicker or thinner depending on your design. I only have a top slab here. Uh, I didn't create one at the bottom. There's way more things that I can go ahead and, and do to this uh, grasshopper script, but this is one that I had actually saved a while ago, and I had never really showed it to anyone, or I had even forgot a, a lot of the things that I had done to it. And so here I am. I just wanted to share it with everyone, and this is something that you can literally open and just have it work. And at the end, we have here the objects grouped. So let me bake this. Okay, and then you'll see we have a very nice and clean 3D model that we can bring into our, you know, construction documents and makes it just makes it a lot easier and it's very clean and it's very accurate. So as you can see here. And then if we copy this, we're able to kind of, let's see, typical staircase and so yeah that's uh, that's a grasshopper script that I uh, that I created I can I'm gonna create I could create a tutorial if you guys want me to show you all the steps of how exactly I created it but for now if you wanna if you are kinda intimidated by grasshopper which I was at the beginning you can go ahead and just download this and and just uh, push and pull and, and get an idea of kind of how it works but if you're familiar with it you should be able to to really uh, create really be able to update this it's a little bit messy I try to organize it as much as I could but even the handle here has a has a radius that it, you know you can make it thicker or thinner you can the even the height 
of that rail is in here somewhere. Let's see, number of steps. We have the the t height of the steps, so you can make it six, seven inches. You know, if it, you want it really steep for a tower, seven inches for residential, six inches for commercial. It all it all really depends. And so, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys all uh, a a little preview of some of the scripts that I have a lot more. So if you want to see more of these. Um, I can share them with you guys and I can also create a tutorial of how I created it which is it's been a while since I've done it so it might take it might not be it might not be the best but it, it'll give you an idea of how it, it you can create this and it seems complex it seems intimidating but in all honesty once you do it one step at a time and at the end you'll have a, a final product that looks complicated and it looks intimidating but it really isn't Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this tutorial. Let me know if you have any questions, if you want me, if you have any questions about the exact steps or yeah, anything else. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching.